In this documentary, you'll learn about the design, building, and flying of the B-24 during World War II. And you'll meet the crews that fly and maintain her today. What's the with that? It kind of speeds up the... The remaining few looks back to the stories of four extraordinary men connected to this venerable aircraft. Jimmy Stewart, an international movie star who leaves his career to join the Army, eventually becoming a B-24 command pilot. Carl L. Norden, a Dutch mechanical engineer who designed the super-secret Norden bombsite. David R. Davis, a self-taught aerodynamicist who designed the B-24's amazing low-drag high-performance wing. And Lieutenant General Frank M. Andrews, commander of the U.S. European Theater of Operations and the first of four lieutenant generals to die during World War II. In front of the Indiana County Courthouse in Indiana, Pennsylvania, stands a statue of Mr. Jimmy Stewart. My mom said there'd be no bombs. Oh, really? Well, you proved mom wrong, didn't you? Uh-huh. There's actually bombs in it. I got to travel with a bunch of my friends. It was probably one of the most incredible experiences of my life. Just, it's like history come to life. I think it's great, but they don't make them for fat people. It's always good if the pilot hugs uh, the, the fat people. Everybody calls me Pappy. I'm the oldest guy here. And um, I've been asked to explain something about taxing the B-24. Well, it's that way in battle, and it happens so fast, it's like a car wreck. That's the closest simile I can give you, a car wreck. Uh, you would think these things in the movies go on and keep shooting back and forth, but it's bang, bang, and jump. <laughs> Fighter plane never turned an Air Force ball group back. You win. <laughs>